All right, Jonathan, looking ahead to that Saturday, weather looking great. The farmer's market at Scissor Tail Park kicked off its third season this past weekend. You can shop fresh, locally sourced produce, and while you're there, you can also enjoy a lot of free community programs like cooking demos, story time, yoga, just a lot to do out there. With us live now is the farmer's market manager, Mary Bixler. Mary, thank you so much for being here with us. Thanks so much for having me. I, I know you were just looking at the weather and you were excited mm -hmm. to see Saturday looks good. <laughs> yes, yeah. Low okay. winds, beautiful sunny day. We're praying for it. This time of year is wild. Uh, yeah, and <laughs> it's perfect weather for the farmer's market. This is mm -hmm. the third season, and it seems like every year just gets better and better. Uh, kind of just fill us in. How did the first day go last, this past Saturday? Oh, yeah, it was fantastic. Like you said, it was, it was the most beautiful day out at the park, and we were so excited to welcome so many um, new producers coming from all across Oklahoma City and kind of the surrounding area. Lots of fresh food producers as well as some specialty items and beverages, some stuff like that. And we also had a lot of um, our returning producers that were really fantastic. Um, we're really excited to keep committing to a um, producer only market. So really we just allow our market space for people who are growing, making all their own things from Oklahoma. Um, so we're able to kind of spotlight and highlight Oklahoma's food culture and a lot of really cool things that people are making in the city. Um, so we also had, you know, some live music that day. We had a fitness hour, farmer's market fitness is what we're doing yeah. <laughs> every morning now just to kind of have, you know, talk about wellness um, and nutrition and all these kind of different elements while we're talking about food at the same time. So we're really excited to kind of continue with some of that programming that you mentioned. We'll do, you know, cooking demonstrations and things like that throughout the season. But this last Saturday, our opening day was really fun because we got to kind of do it in tandem with um, the Wind Festival at Scissor Tell Park, which was so fantastic. And there were just kites everywhere across the park and, it, you know, everything's blooming and the daffodils are beautiful in the park right now. So it was really a beautiful day to kind of celebrate the spring and fresh food and beautiful weather coming to us finally. Yeah, okay, I'm sold. Yeah, I yeah, need, yeah I come need, out. I need to get out there. <laughs> uh, you talked about uh, being an exclusive producer only market mm -hmm. um, and you kind of talked a little bit about what that was. Why is that so important? Yeah, no, that's a great question. We, we think that's really important just because, um, you know, with some, me included, you know, I have some autoimmune conditions, so my, my food choices are really, really important to me to know what's going into my food. And so we really just want to encourage people and empower people to ask, um, you know, the folks that are making their food those types of questions. You know, what are you feeding your chickens that I'm going to eat? You know, how are you growing these vegetables? Because maybe I can't have a certain chemical or certain or something like that, you know, so people have to be really particular about what they're eating. So we just really like to encourage that direct to consumer, um, you know, conversation about and kind of be closer to the food that we're eating and kind of, you know, shorten that that chain and that connection. And we think that's really, really important. And sometimes that can be hard um, in a farmer's market. I think people expect that's what you're getting anyways. But I think, you know, we're committing to that to say this is the person that, you know, made your food and you're able to talk to them and learn about what's in season you know, learn tips and tricks on how to eat with those ingredients or how to cook with bison and all these different things. So we really like to encourage that direct to consumer marketplace um, just to kind of shorten the chain. Right. That's very important. Yeah, and it and is. this is family friendly. It's for something for everyone. Right. A lot of different kind of vendors out there. Mm -hmm. Give us the details, how long the farmer's market lasts, the times, everything we need to know. Yes, absolutely. We run um, every Saturday through the end of October from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. Um, and we're on the north east corner of Scissor Tail Park, right about Oklahoma City Boulevard and South Robinson. Um, like I said, we're there every Saturday, rain or shine yeah. or wind, <laughs> as much as the weather wants to give us, we'll be there. Um, and we have, yeah, live music every Saturday. We'll have all of our fantastic vendors as well. We'll have bilingual children's story time every Saturday. We'll have yoga every Saturday. Um, and then we'll kind of feed in those educational programs, you know, composting, um, gardening, sustainability, as well as um, cooking preservation preparation. So we'll do some pickling classes some canning classes. So I think there's, you know, something for everybody who wants to come out and, you know, Scissor Tail Park is beautiful yeah, right now. It is. It's greening up. It's just a beautiful green space to come spend time with your dog or your family or just sit on the lawn. So we would, we would love to have everybody 
come out through the season. You know, the produce will be coming on a little stronger as we continue and hopefully don't have any late freezes or <laughs> crazy wild weather, but um, it's, it's going to be a really good time. Yeah, Oklahoma weather is unpredictable, but Mary, thank you. You've been amazing. I didn't even have to ask you any questions. She oh, covered it oh, all. You're so awesome. Thanks you covered it all. Thank you so much. Yeah. And everybody get out to the farmer's market. You have plenty of time every Saturday and it should be a great season. Yes. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right, everyone. We'll be right back after this.